If you guys have watched my videos, you know I love mechanical stuff. I love taking things apart, putting them back together, fixing things, just figuring out how things work. I've always had a fascination with locks and opening locks. Uh, and so, like when I bought this bike, um, this cable lock came on one of the bikes I, buy, bikes I bought. So anyway, I was going to go ahead. I got to I got to figure out how to open it. You know, just I could have cut it off with a bolt cutter or whatever. Um, but no, I had to figure out how to get it off there. I could have tried just rotating these dials until I came up with the right combination, just brute force. But I'm going to show you an easier way. Um, one thing I've already done, it's already sprayed the dials down with WD-40 so that they're moving nice and smoothly. They were a little bit stiff to begin with. And having them move smoothly definitely helps uh, opening it like this. The cable comes out this way. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and pull the cable out and kind of push it with my thumb here so I'm kind of pulling the cable out. Now one of these dials should have a little bit more resistance than the other three dials and it's this first dial. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and just rotate this around until it almost falls into like a little hole, like a little kind of catches and right there it seemed to catch, it seemed to fall right there. So now I'm going to uh, find one of these other dials now should have more resistance and it's the second dial. They might not necessarily be order, so it could be like the first one and the third one or the fourth one then the second one but right now it's the second one so I'm going to rotate this around until it seems to fall into a hole and right there it seemed to fall into a hole so now if I got it one of these other dials should be a little stiffer and it's this dial right here, the third dial, so I'm going to go ahead rotate that and it seemed to see, fall into a hole right there so I'm going to, hopefully that's it, so now I'm going to up, and there's resistance now on this first dial. So I'm going to go ahead, rotate this first dial, ah, and right there. So I got that. And let me see. And right there's combination, 7598. And that's how you open one of these combination locks. 